for the majority of my younger career, it was, very, uh, it was a very commercially minded career. My brother and I had had a brief stint within an independent film scene, but as, as any actor will know, that's not really something that is too gracious with the financial stability, and uh, my brother and I were also supporting our family at the time. So a lot of the choices that were made were very commercially minded. And as I've gotten older, I've had the ability and agency to be able to see projects through my own lens of taste and balance that art and commerce. Due to the commercial nature of something like Riverdale, the question becomes, okay, how do I pursue other roles or fashion other roles in order to also satisfy the artistic side of this industry. But you know, you only really sign up for the pilot when, when you film these things, so you have no idea how long it's actually gonna, gonna go for, and uh, I got very lucky with that. Uh, but I, I also think it's a tremendous commercial opportunity, and I, I think the, the business side of myself was going, yeah, you should look into this as well. The wild card in the planning of someone's career within the entertainment arts is always going to be public perception. And it's a matter of being able to try and control your public perception. It's really always going to be the factor most out of your control. Oftentimes with child stardom, I think, the public views you as an immature public commodity. And then the question becomes as you start to age and you start to have these advanced um, feelings about your own self-identity and sexuality and as you age you, you start to question how to change the public persona so that they see you the same way you see your own identity. And I figured the best way to do that would just be to go to university. Take some time with a bit more anonymity to, to evolve as a person and then after I had graduated and received a diploma the public would ideally recognize that rite of passage as something more mature and I could come out the other side and, and be seen as something more mature. I think knowing yourself well enough to take some time away from this industry and, and mature outside of the public eye is a fundamental, fundamental thing you can start meditating on if you're a young actor. I happen to think university, if you have the privilege, because it is a tremendous privilege to go, university is really wonderful way to, to kind of achieve the maturity publicly that, that I think so many of us were so desperate for.